Hi everyone, Rosie here. This is part two of drawing my subscribers profile pictures, so let's get right to it. Okay, so if you're real on, you might remember my last drawing profile pictures video where I drew um, IDKs, Rainbow Doodles, and XXRTXX. This video is really fun, but I really feel like I've improved since then, so I really want to try this again with three new profile pictures. So yeah, that is what we're going to be doing t uh, today. Alrighty, so I'll show you guys the first one in the moment. But yeah, so I chose three people for this video, and the first one is Savannah Sketches. So yeah, I'm so excited to draw this one because I think her profile picture is so cute. Alrighty, here's what it looks like. It's like this girl drawn in pencil with like this really colorful background. And yes, that's what we're going to be doing. I really want to give this girl a special shout out because um, she has been like one of my biggest supporters who wasn't already friends and family on my channel. And she's just been so supportive and so nice commenting on my videos. And yeah, so like I just really um, feel really grateful to her. And I really wanted to draw her profile picture. So yeah, alrighty. So I wanted to tell you guys how I draw in pencil. So like you saw, I kind of did a rough outline. And this time I'm kind of going over it and doing a more concrete outline before I start shading right now. A lot of you guys asked, have asked for drawing tutorials and shading tutorials. So if you guys want me to make a video about that, then that would definitely be possible. But yeah, this is kind of how I do it. This took me a little while just kind of going through and shading and blending and sketching and everything. So yeah, just enjoy the time lapse. <clears throat> and I also wanted to say that one of my shorts recently got like 300,000 views. It was one of my inside out shorts. And I just cannot believe that. That's honestly so crazy. That's more than any short I've ever drawn has gotten by far. So I'm just so, so grateful and got me so many new subscribers. And our channel has been growing so big. So thank you guys so, so much. And we are getting so um, much more growth. So yeah, thank you guys. Alrighty, now I'm just going to do some highlighting. I always like to highlight um, my pencil drawings. Just because I think it gives it a little bit more of a sparkle and a pop. So yeah. Alrighty, so next we're going to be using these acrylic markers. And some of you guys might have remembered my um, 1000 Artsy Special from um, about a month ago. And... I basically did a mini review of these markers, non-sponsored, while I was doing that video. So if you guys want to go check that out, it's the last video I posted. And I will link it down below if you want to check out the review of these markers. So yeah. I really just wanted to capture the background of her profile picture with these markers. And I wanted it to look kind of like the box. And I realized I probably would have done this easier with alcohol markers. But I just really was in the mood to try something different and use these acrylic markers. So that's kind of what we're doing right now. And it didn't actually end up being as big a disaster as I thought it would, so I think it turned out pretty good. I think this picture is turning out so cute, and I really love drawing your profile pictures in my style. So, yeah. And if you guys like this video, maybe we can do a part three as well. I'm kind of planning on that because I got a lot more requests than I thought, and I definitely can't make it all in this video. So, yeah. Alrighty, we're all, all, like, finishing up on Savannah Sketches. If you guys like it, I hope Savannah Sketches likes it. And the next person is going to be Miriam Salazar. And this girl has also been so, so supportive. And her profile picture is so cute. It's, like, this little, like, cinemaro type animal thing. And I think it's so adorable. Like, the flowers and everything. It's just such a vibe. <clears throat> and we're going to be drawing that. Okay, so I'm going to make a, uh, like a light outline, and then I am going to draw this one out on pen, because I kind of just want a bit of a sharper outline, and we are going to do this again later, but keep watching. So yeah, alrighty, so I just really want to draw this one right here, because I thought it matched the color palette of Savannah Sketches so well, because just like pastel pinks, and just pastel colors in general, I think they go so well together, and so I decided to continue the theme of using these acrylic markers, and yeah, so I'm thinking that's going pretty well here. And I probably could have gone in with alcohol markers at this point. I did use a gray marker and a colorless blender for the shadows. But I just really wanted to really get the full experience of these acrylic markers and make this whole video acrylic markers. So yeah. And I think this picture is turning out pretty good. And I really hope that you guys like these. This was honestly so fun. And um, if you guys want your profile pictures drawn, please comment down below. Or if the comments are off, again, you can comment on one of my community posts. I read all my comments. So, yes. I also try to at least heart or respond on my comments. Um, sometimes they slip through the cracks because just there's a lot of them on some videos. But I really do try. And I always read them all. Anyways, okay. So, back to the drawing. I was giving this thing a little blue dress. And I just think it is it's literally so adorable. And the little hat is so adorable, too. It's all just so cute. 
and I just really love it. Yeah, I just cannot believe how many more views and subscribers we've been getting lately. And I want to thank you guys so, so much because I almost never thought I would get to this point. And yeah, kind of going all over the place tonight, but yeah. I kind of owe you guys a mini apology because I wanted to get this video out like um, a month ago. Because I put the post out a few months ago and I don't really know why it's taken me this long. It just has. So yeah, I'm sorry for making you guys wait so long. But yeah, so let's just enjoy the moment and be thankful the video finally got done. Because I didn't know if it would, honestly. Still don't know why. <laughs> yeah, okay, so now we're just doing this pink background. And this took me a while to get it all nice and um, flat and not looking like um, streaky and uh, different layers. I just wanted it to be a nice pink background. And I think we achieved that. I really wanted this page to look nice and full. And then the picture kind of has a bit of a like a yellow glow in the corner. So I kind of wanted to try to achieve that with this peach marker and the yellow. Which was a little bit hard to blend all in. But I think we kind of managed it in the end. So yeah. Alrighty, we are getting pretty close here. I'm going to color the clouds orange. And then I decided I'm going to give them a little bit of a pink highlight. And a bit of a pink shadow because I thought that looked pretty cute. And then we'll be on to highlighting pretty soon. So yeah, this picture is almost done. Again, I just wanted to say thank you to both of these girls for just being so nice and um, supportive of my channel. And yeah. Okay, now we're just going to be doing a bit of black outlining. Because I wanted the picture to look a, bit, a little bit... Oh my god. I cannot talk. A little bit crisper and just like more clean. And then um, I did a bit of highlighting just to make it pop. And then added some sparkles. Okay, finish that, and this is how it looks. I hope you like it, Miriam. All right, next we're going on to Maida L. And I was really excited for this one because I think her profile picture is so cool looking. It's like this quote that says, let your creativity shine, and then her name and subscribe. And then it has this really nice, like, kind of, like, um, sketchy, like, surreal background. And I was so, so excited because that was going to be such a fun challenge. Um, thank you, Maida, for all your nice comments and support. Again, all three of these people so nice and make sure to check out their channels or profile pictures or just profiles if you want to so yeah i will link them down below and um i will also link um my previous video with the art supplies review so yeah i'll do all of that for you guys so this has just been really fun and i just wanted to say if your profile picture did not get chosen please 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 do not be disappointed because there's a very good chance it will get drawn in part three and i just could not draw all, the, all of these it was a struggle to get the video down to this amount of time because it was literally hours of footage i can't believe i got it down to 10 minutes lots of speeding up you guys lots of speeding up anyways but yeah so please don't be disappointed and just keep watching for the next video and i really want to draw all your profile profile pictures but i don't know if that's gonna be possible but yeah like i said if you want yours drawn as well comment down below and it may very well get drawn and i really try to keep my comments on as much as i can but they just always turn off on me even though i've literally tried everything but they always just want to turn off and they don't want to stay on so if they are off just please comment on a community post or something like that i will see it um if you want me to make sure i really see it make make sure to comment on the profile picture community post so yeah sorry about that and I really just thought these three pictures went really well, to well together. Just moving on to a new topic. And I thought the pastels really complemented each other. And this one was so fun to do because of all the streaky colors. It was kind of blending in the sky. This might have taken me the longest, honestly, just because it took so long to layer all the colors. And then there was these really pretty purple clouds that I just loved. And I realized I was going to end up having to go back over the words when I was finished because it was just not realistic to try to color around them. So, yeah, that's what I'm doing at the moment. And I really just want to shade these clouds and make them look really pretty. And yeah. Okay, so now I'm doing the Let Your Creativity Shine part. And then I'm going to be coloring in the Maida L part with this purple marker. And I'm thinking this is looking so pretty. Just going to add the stars and some sparkles as the finishing touches. If you guys like this video, make sure to give it a like down below. And if we get to, let's say, 20 likes, I will make a part 3. So yeah. And 20 likes is not very much, so I think we can definitely do it. Alrighty, here's how the picture looks. And here's how this one looks. Um, Savannah Sketches. And then we have Miriam Salazar. <clears throat> and then finally, of course, Maida L up here. I hope you guys had fun in this video as much as I did. Because this was so, so, so much fun. Please like, subscribe, share, 
comment all the fun stuff thank you guys so so much as you can see i left space for part three and i will see you guys in the next video have a fabulous day and bye